Hello friends, subscribers and new viewers of this channel. In this tutorial I will explain how to fix camera issues in Ubuntu 24.04. Namely, I recently installed Ubuntu 24.04 and I tried to test my web camera that I often use for OpenCV and other applications. However, I was not able to run the camera on Ubuntu. Then after some investigation I realized the following. Namely, by the version 22.04 the default program that comes from Ubuntu, that comes with Ubuntu and that's used to record images and record videos is cheese. However, since Ubuntu version 24.04 this program is changed to snapshot. So over here you can see that other users are also reporting this issue that camera is not working. So let's test this problem. So click here and search for camera and you will see this default app. However, this default app is actually called Snapshot. Now, if you try to run it and if you leave it for some time, the program will not be able to recognize your camera, although your camera might be attached to the USB port. And this is a serious problem for people who are playing with OpenCV or using, for example, ROS in Linux Ubuntu. Let's learn how to solve this problem in Linux Ubuntu 24.04. Now, even if you press over here, you'll have issues closing this program. So let's use terminal to kill this process. Open a terminal and over here just type PSEF to see the program. This might be difficult to identify the program like that. So the easiest way is to do something like this and to type the name of the program that should be snapshot. And here you here is the PID over here. Actually it's this one. So let's just type kill with the option 9 that will actually send the kill signal and this process and now the camera is closed and we can continue. First, let's try to follow this recommendation on the stack exchange of Ubuntu, although I'm not 100% sure that this will work. However, let's try it out. Okay, so the first thing that they're actually saying that we should, oops, let me, let me do this, that we should do sudo apt update. Okay, let's do that, although I'm not very optimistic that this, oops, let me just do it perfectly, sudo apt update. Here it is. I'm not very optimistic that this, this will actually work. And then they say that we should restart pipeware. So let's do that. This is a very powerful command, system CTL. And, and again, as you can see over here, the problem persists. So this will not work in my case. There might be an issue with the camera or with the program or something like that. And over here, you can actually see some debug information that might be useful to debug. So let's press Control C over here to close the camera. And let's try to use another approach such that you can use camera on your system. Okay, so the second approach is actually to install Cheese. Cheese is the default program for viewing, for taking images and recording videos from Ubuntu 22.04. So let's run, first of all, sudo apt install snapd and then let's run this to install cheese and let's see this bang now the cheese should be installed here you should be patient and that's it so let's try to run cheese click here and search for cheese and here it is let's run it and let's hope that everything will be fine now it's running and you can see that actually the video or actually the photo is being taken good this is good okay however you might still experience some issues with cheese so let's investigate on an alternative option it's always good to have several options when you want to do something so let's close this one and let's go over here to app center or let me just first close this app center to show you how to get to the app center click here and search for App Center. 
App Center is an alternative way for installing programs in Linux Ubuntu. And over here, search for camera. So let's see what will be the cameras. Okay, advanced web camera and camera controls for Linux. Good. You can install some of the programs over here. You have this Digicam. And I will try this program, for example, Camoso. So let's install it. Here I need to enter my password. And let's see if we can install this program and use it. Now it's being installed, so let's be patient. And over here you have different options. I will choose this, for example, latest, and this is the stable. Always choose the stable option. This was the default option. So let's now be patient and let's wait. Okay, so after some time, you will see that the installation progress is completed and we can open Camoso. So let's click here to open it up. And here it is. And you can see that actually I can take images of my room. However, this looks quite slow. So probably I need to adjust a few things such as, for example, frame rate or something similar. Okay, but at least we can use the camera and we can get some images. This is very good. Now you can also start this program by clicking here then searching for the program name Camoso and here it is simply start it, start it and you can take images, record video or do a lot of things and here you have a bunch of properties you can click here to configure you will save files in this folder, videos you will save here, and you can probably even configure this thing, or you can add some effects to your video. Okay, that's all for today. I hope that you like this video. If you like the videos I'm creating, please press the like and subscribe buttons. Thanks a lot, and have a nice day.